talk about the solar eclipse that's going to happen on April 8th, 2024. It's going to be an exciting eclipse because the path of totality crosses North America. So there's a lot of states that are going to get to see the path of totality. So you want to check out where that is because getting to see an eclipse within the path of totality is a really amazing experience. There isn't going to be another one crossing North America for decades. So one of the easiest ways to view the partial phases of the eclipse before the moon completely covers the sun is with eclipse glasses. So when you put the eclipse glasses on, you can't see anything. Except if you looked at the sun, you would see an orange disk. Another way to view the eclipse safely is a pinhole projector. And it's easy to make. It's made with, with things that you probably have around your house right now. So if I was gonna use this to look at the sun, whether there's an eclipse going on or not, I would certainly face away from the sun. I would point the pinhole at the sun and angle my pinhole projector so that the image of the sun is projected and I'm looking at it through the hole on the white note card at the back of the box. Another way to do this, if you don't have a box, you can just take a, like a mat board like this, cut a square hole in it, put a pinhole in the aluminum foil that you've taped to the side here, and just make your own pinhole projector like this. So remember, if you have glasses, that is the only time during the partial eclipse that you can aim your vision towards the sun. Everything else, all these projection methods, you should be looking away from the sun, down towards the ground or whatever you have your pinhole light projected onto. But to get out there, try lots of different pinhole projectors because there's lots of things you can try. And that's some of the fun of enjoying the partial eclipse is seeing what makes the best pinhole projector and really enjoy this eclipse because it's gonna be an amazing event that isn't gonna happen again for many years.